Hey there, I'm Tom from BarLenses.com, and on today's quick tip, we're gonna talk about Nikon's FTZ adapter for Z-series cameras. The FTZ adapter enables you to mount F-glass to bodies like this, the Nikon Z7. You may have seen our Canon EOS R adapter video, and we're gonna put this adapter through the same paces. Nikon says the FTZ adapter enables you to use F-glass and experience benefits the Z-series cameras offer. This includes Nikon's smooth and fast hybrid autofocus, silent shooting, and vibration reduction. Sounds appealing to me. As with most adapters, there always exists the concern of latency between the body and adapted lens or vignetting. Nikon makes no indication that you would experience such issues. Let's put it to the test. Here we have Nikon's brand new 35mm f1.8 Z lens, and next to it Nikon's 35mm 1.4 G lens. Let's mount up the new lens and see how it performs. Reasonably quick and whisper quiet. Now let's mount the 35mm G lens with the Nikon FTZ adapter. In this case, the autofocus seems just as fast, though it's a little noisier. No fault of the FTZ, however. And finally, we brought in a third-party contender, the Sigma 35mm f1.4 art lens. Let's see how it performs. The Sigma seems to work pretty well, but we're finding that it hunts a little bit to find focus. Still nothing too detrimental. It's also worth mentioning that we're not seeing that any of these lenses are vignetting with the adapter. The Nikon Z7 pairs well with Nikon's F-mount lenses and third-party options. And if you don't mind the clunky FTZ adapter, you can use your favorite lenses with Nikon's 5-axis image stabilization. So there you have it. Got a question? Leave a comment, check out the blog, or rent this camera for yourself at barlenses.com. And thanks for watching.